This video is about how to make blend shapes in Blender and export it to Unity for your gaming needs. What you need to do is create your object. In my case, I'll keep the standard cube. So let's delete these. And just a standard cube. Now in the data tab right here, this is called the data tab. And so each object, you select the object and you click on the data tab. In the data tab, there is a drop down menu called shape keys right here. Shape keys. Push on the plus button to add a basis layer right here. Add a shape key. It creates a basis layer. This basis layer is important because it determines the original shape that all other shapes blend to. Add another shape by clicking on the plus button again. So I'll just press this, add a shape key, and it says key one. So this is another key, another blend shape. Rename the shape layer by double clicking on it and typing out twist. This way we know what this blend shape layer does, right? This is important because when this exports to Unity, it would say twist. What you have to make sure of is that the correct shape layer is always selected. If you select basis, then it's going to be on basis and it would edit in basis. But if you select twist, it would edit and twist. The twist would be editing. If you have the wrong shape layer selected when you edit your object, then you'll be editing the wrong shape layer and will give you undesirable results. Make sure you have the twist layer shape selected. Then press the tab button to enter editing mode. Select the top four vertices of the cube. Rotate the vertices on the Z axis just a little bit. So rotate Z and we're just gonna rotate just a little bit so that the cube looks like it's twisted. Now press the tab key again to exit edit mode and you can see that the cube is not twisted anymore. That is because the blend shape value hasn't been changed yet. Right here, this is the value. Value of shape key at the current frame. Change the value to see the blend shape change. See that? It's twisting. It's twisting based on this value between two different points. Basically the translation of the vertices. The vertices are exactly identical on the basis and the twist. And so it just simply translates between the two put positions. That's how a blend shape technically works. We're going to export this cube as FBX file. So we're going to say export FBX. And we're going to just put it right into my game. FBX, all right. Now inside of Unity, for objects, yeah, there it is. All right, it would just. And then right here, this is where blend shapes is right here in this twist so that you know exactly what you're getting and it twists inside unity and you can animate this. This is an animatable object and it works perfectly. That's it. So good luck in creating all your endeavors.